Always good to see you in Ops, Commander. Interface initiated. Look at that terrain. Now I want ice cream. Position confirmed. I've got something. Position confirmed. Ready to rock.
Let's get to go. Time to fly. Be a miss. Hey there. Roger. Receiving you. Acknowledged. Firing. This target's taking a critical hit. All weapons are go. That's a kill. Hey, right, yo. Roger, Skipper. Kicking it. Acknowledged. Waiting on you, Commander. Standing by. I hear ya. Location confirmed. Affirmative.
four. Critical hit. Confirmed. Roger that, Commander. Engaging target. Standing by. Confirmed. Critical hit, Commander. My internals are taking a beating! Confirmed. Taking heavy hits, Commander. How's it going? Copy that. Copy that.
orders. Jumpman's got a scout. He's gonna stay out of range of these turrets, actually. I think he's just gonna go fire. Get that shot. He's gonna just take down the building. Engaging target. Well, he's covered. He's got a turret. Another turret. One less structure. Enemy structure eliminated. What's the mission? The mission is to take down the turret. That's one building out of five. What can I do for ya? Let's get the Panther up there. It's PPC. It's a low range damage. Yeah, the input. Need something, Chief? Get up in these trees. Yeah, Roger. The next turn. We got pinball. She's in the pants. The pants are Scott. It's got for weapons. It's got PPC, long range. It's got SRM for short range. It's fairly well armored, so it can take a bit of damage. And it's got no shots. Double time! Next up, the Empire. Receiving you. Lots of energy weapons. Lots of damage to the reasonable armor. If I put them there, it'll be able to be hit by everything, so we're going to move him up further. We're going to move him up to here. Then we can take out the wind turret. Blocked by the wall. Target's one turret. you got to watch his heat. Because all these energy weapons, he heats up pretty good. I think you'll need all this. We're going to save the ammo because you actually run out of ammunition with missile weapons and ballistic weapons. Oh, Still to Turret destroyed. Back to the Receiving you. He's taking some damage. You can see by the grayed out areas, but we haven't gone through armor yet. Got those long range missiles. So as long as Moving to position. You can shoot the missiles in there. Precision strike. Yeah. Engaging. You get precision strike when you target certain parts. I've only done that with missiles before, and LRM5 is not that good. Hit her. But hey, it's a jump next year. Jump man and the spider. Come on, game. He jumped him up here. And he can suddenly be targeted by everything in the universe. So, 
good to go. Walk around and destroy everything. Locking up. I'm going to try to take him overheat next time. You'll see kind of what happens. Um, that didn't hit? No overheat in the fight. Right now, it goes overheat. Order. I'm going to take damage to parts. You can see as the vindicator gets closer, the chunker running, and now we can shoot LRMs. We can shoot direct fire. So then here, face the problem. Right? Affirmative. Now we can shoot because he's got multi weapons with him. He's got a medium laser. Small laser, it's only shoots early in situations where you're really close. This is kind of an odd one. The LRM. As you gain skills, you're going to get a multi targeting but right now he doesn't have that. So, we're going to turn off the LRM. Just target this building, check your heat. Fire. We really don't need that much. Taking the shot. There goes the building. That's three. Two more buildings to go. Flatten that one. Yeah. Right. Orders? Come on, let's take down a building. Hey up. I don't know why, but the, the portraits made for your characters don't come from the customized area back into the game, so you can do that stuff to be 10-4. Target down. One more building to go. I hear ya. Good to go. Let's see if she can target it. Again. SRMs, PPC, fire. Tell me what to shoot. Oh, almost. Almost takes it down. I may need some more time in the simulator. She hasn't taken down any buildings yet. So we're gonna do this, yes, you take Commander. a character who has a higher initiative, and well, you can't help other characters, so I guess we just gotta do it. So we'll run him up to the top. Two faster mechs. I don't think there's going to be any surprises. Waiting for orders. Beginning level, so they're pretty easy. Let's have them shoot some long range missiles. Coordinates received. Okay. Firing on target. Short range missiles and there's long range missiles. Orders? Give What's up, Emperor. boss? The Emperor's gonna finish it off. Aye aye. Get your lance Go. to the LZ commander. I'm coming in hot. Okay, if you've killed everything. Oh, it looks like we still have enemies here. If we killed all the enemies on the map, the dropship would come to us, but we have to get to the LZ. Right down there. Also has jump jets. You can jump to the bottom of the hill and check Copy that. See if you're bigger man. No contacts. Next steps. Jump in. That's what he's supposed to do. You don't want to jump him when there's no cover, so we're going to jump into the trees just in case there's something. 10 4. Panther. Taking the high road! There's gotta be something else here. Yeah, we So, looks like we just have to get those four units into the, the LZ. So, Emperor's also gonna jump. Jenner's great. Got lots of mobility, good weaponry. Take a little bit of damage. Okay, we're almost there. Lead him in, Chunker. Don't jump in. Oh, it's not a big slow man. Just to get straight in. Nope. More mobile to jump. Can't quite make it. Yet. Roger that. I think there's going to be a surprise here. Well, just in case. We 
Waiting on you, Commander. Up there to first. Panther and the Vindicator are there. The firepower, a little bit of armor. When you brace or use vigilance, you get added bonuses to your resolve. Venting your heat. Guard position. And we got here the Emperor. He said he was hot, but he's not. Sometimes the voice messages don't make sense. But we'll jump him into the trees just in case I'm sure. Excellent. A little later mission, right place. Last week, you suddenly have all sorts of mechs all over you, so you gotta be careful. All right, let the big guy walk in and see if anything shows up. On my way. Looks like we're okay. Let's go break. I'm gonna have a spider. I'm gonna jump in and get a spider and check out the trees over here. I need to find out if Affirmative. Enemy enemies nearby that we need to take out for extra points. And I'll have the Emperor in his... Dinner. Waiting for orders. And over here. Roger. When you're in this mode where there's no enemies, you're not in attack mode. You can quickly move the unit. So Got it. One unit, unit to move before the other unit. There we go. Landing area. Yeah, we'll jump, hey, jump over this hill. See if there's anything on this side. Copy that. Reconnoiter. Oh yeah, there is. What is that? Oh, it's a turret. Commander? The general over there. Move into position. And we will take... What can I do for you? I leap! I soar! Roger that. Picking in. The chatter can get annoying. Waiting on you, Commander. There she goes. Now she can get a shot. Uh-huh. Hopefully just one turret left. That gets you a full point. Sometimes you get bonus. Oh, maybe four. Let's we'll see. Alright. She's got an 8 chance. Time to die! Oh, yeah. <laughs> Fires and... Systems recycling building, for huh? another yeah. shot! Yeah, the Emperor has no patience. Yet. Ready for orders. The Emperor is going to go down and... On the move. When it's cooled down, as you can see, and this also shows things like uh, increases your heat sinking ability. So this is a cold area. We're in the trees, so we're going to get a guarded condition. Guarded condition is 20% damage reduction. But he also gets a minus one attack in the trees and he's smooth. But we're going to fire everything. And, uh, you could do a precision strike, which I don't know if that would be the Fire section doesn't seem to matter. So, let's fire. Roger that. This is a very good map. Drop ship to come to your position is to have your position. Reporting. Turret eliminated. Confirm. Destroy everything. Jump two, there you go. So when you jump, you saw it briefly as you saw You can't see to attack it. Bracing for impact. But uh, couldn't bosh. When you jump, you're hard to hit, but you also don't have that much left aim in yourself, so you get minus one. Good to go. Emperor's gonna run over here. Position to fire at it. Because it's right here. Look if we can block it. So now that means it has a line on him. He has a line of sight on it. He doesn't have range, but it might have range on him. On my way. Be careful. Closing in on it, using the building as cover. You'll see it. Pinball group close to her. What can I do for you? Get it with her. Yeah, she can. So she can see what's having eight percent chance. Let's see what happens. That. This time. Firing on target. He hits it. The PPCs aren't 
energy and weapons aren't that great against structure. Yep. See, we need to kill for it. Jump in. A little dangerous there, because if I put him up here, he might get shot at. Location confirmed. Chance. He's got two medium lasers. It's okay. Take it out. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. So now we've got them all. We get that bonus. There's bonus. Mission that's success. A bonus salvage. Now we fly back to the ship. The Argo. It's our drop ship. Actually, I think it's orbital. So, because in our negotiations we took low pay and high salvage, we get 18,000, which isn't much. We beat all the different aspects of the mission. Top tier work, Commander. House Merrick is very happy with your performance. Keep it up and make sure you get lots more work. And then you've gained reputation with the world, Free Roads League, the Merricks, and lost reputation with the local pirates. But your morale has run up, and the mercenary you do board, Come in here, you see, so we see Spider took some damage. So he'll have to go to Mech Bay to, to his rear left torso. Gained 400 experience each. But no one else, so he got killed. Chunker got a Mech kill. Spider got a tank kill. Or a turret kill. Uh, Pinball got no kills, and then <laughs> the Emperor got a Mech and three turrets. So when you come in here, if there's, depending on how much salvage you have, you have the option of dragging your select pieces in. There's only three pieces of salvage on this mission, which sucks, which means we screwed up on our negotiations. So you take what you want, and then when you hit confirm, if there's any more here, the, the game will decide which ones you get. Now once you're back in base, once you're back on the ship in orbit, Then you're going to get something, a chance to heal, train your units, the experience points allow you to increase your skills, that kind of stuff. So that's the Argo. And when you're here, you get to go to the hiring hall where you can hire other mercenaries if you need them. You go to the local store. Every local store has mech parts, weapons that are unique to the area. Sometimes you'll find special weapons like this one, Auto Cannon 5, a Kaliyama. Gets a plus 10 bonus to damage, especially, but they're quite expensive. And you have a limited amount of funds. And because we just took salvage and not the extra money, we actually didn't gain much money there. But these are the good weapons. So if I had any mechs that used these, I'd probably buy them. I don't There's really nothing here I want. There's a Shadowhawk part, which would be awesome, but that would use up most of my money. Trebuchet, which is a long range vindicator, which matches what we have, Panther and a fire starter, which is very good. But we're not in a position to buy mechs at this point, so we don't need to be there. Hey Commander. Here's where Pull you choose your contracts. This is where we have the Majesty of Canopus, which borders Merrick Space. You also have the House Laeo. Leo? I'm not sure how you'd say that. I'm not sure who these oh this is Comstar. Wow. Oh no, that's planetary government. Okay, they have a mission. And then the pirates will even hire you. You can see this is an easy mission, a little harder, the more skulls there is. When you have the planet here, it means you're going to travel to go on that mission. So you want to watch those, because if you click on them, the way it works in the old Battletech universe is you have seven days transit to your jump ship, which has been charging at the jump point, and it stays out in space, crewed by special spacefaring humans. And once you're on the ship, it jumps to a jump point, which would be where? somewhere else in Merrick Space, Solardian, but that takes 25 days of game time and you only have 1,200 game days to play this game. So you first want to finish these missions and you can see the salvage that's offered. Okay, so we go to the barracks and we look at our roster and we take a What's up, boss? Chunker, and he can go up. So we'll take gunnery, increase. Okay. So you mech warrior training complete. Jump man. Orders. 
Take piloting or gunnery. I think we'll take piloting. This is gonna guts is gonna give you more hit points, tactics. I'm not sure what that whole indirect fire stuff like that. But piloting is gonna give you increased chance to hit. I mean to land and stuff or to fight. And I think we're gonna end. Training confirmed, Commander. He needs piloting because he's a scout and he's always jumping around. Pinball. Good to go. She's got that gunnery problem, so we're gonna give her an training complete. This is Scooter, he's in charge of the mech, this is his unit, Scott Bogdanovich. He's got some pretty good skills already because that's how he starts the game. He's probably going to take this one, so when you hit these points you get a big increase in that skill. You can only do two, once you get this point you can only progress in two of the skills. But I think Gunnery's a good one to choose, so he'll take Gunnery big off the top. Mech Warrior training complete. And then we go down to the Receive. Emperor. He didn't get anything. What the heck? That's interesting. I wonder why. What can I do for you? Waiting for orders. And then you go to the mech bay. It's repairing. Welcome to the, the grease mechs. pit, Commander. You have each of your mechs here. That's the Vindicator. You can look at them. So you see the Vindicator is 45 tons. The Jenner is 35 tons. We have a Commando, which we didn't take out that time. 25 tons. Spider needs some repair. You can choose to repair it or not. It's just superficial. If we go into the spiders, the spider there. You can also change the spider's paint job if you want. And you choose your colors for your unit too. So we went with that color scheme. So you go into repair. You just have to repair the damage, or you go into refit. Or you can change your weaponry. You can choose what you want to repair because when you're tight on money sometimes you have to go into battle without your damage fully repaired. But it's only that torso. Now if we were to click on that, it would take one day for him to be repaired. So that's not a bad thing to do. I don't think I think we could do that. But if we don't repair it, then that means we can go into battle right away. So we're just gonna get out of here. We're not gonna repair the spider, he's just gonna keep his back away from the enemy and doing his best, best scout. Let's we'll kind of click through all the different mechs here so we have that. Panther. You can see the Panther's got different ratings as far as heat efficiency and everything goes. Spider. Commando. The Jenner. And the Vindicator. So there you have it. First mission. So far so good.